I have not reacted to a DJ Cook YouTube video in months, so today I will finally be returning. One day ago, DJ Cook made a video called, I found the worst girl on YouTube, and today I will be reacting to it. And by the way, the other two videos from DJ Cook that I didn't react to, I actually tried reacting to those videos the days they came out, but of course my storage was full, and midway through the video, my storage ran out. And I had to restart the video all over again. And back then I filmed my videos at night time. So I was just too tired to watch that video all over again. So I just did a shorter video that day. So hopefully my storage doesn't run out today. And let's react to this video. Alright, here's the video. Yo, what's up? Yo, what's up? You know up? what's weird to me? Bad YouTubers are almost always boys. I've done over 50 videos on bad YouTubers. Most of the time, we look at like three YouTubers in each video, so that's 150 bad YouTubers that I've looked at. And I've only made a video on about three girls ever. And that's about to change right now. I've the seen other them day, all. I was thinking to myself, why in the world are all of the bad YouTubers some dudes? Um... Uh... I'm a dude, so I could be partially guilty for this, but I've never made a clickbait video in my life, so... But I guess you could say men are more greedy for money and think that, like, weird things. I don't really know how to explain it. Hey guys, she's the worst because she's so cringy. I want to go crazy. So, for this video, I went out That's my sister for you. The worst YouTuber because she's so cringy. To try to find the very worst one. And by the end of this video, once we decide who the worst girl on YouTube truly is, I'm going to try to message her and see if I can convince her to start making better videos. If he actually does that. My girlfriend doesn't get mad at me. On my channel, we try to clean up the bad content on YouTube. So if you want to help me make YouTube a better place, Click subscribe. And if Congrats, your PC is clean now. Sit back and enjoy my videos. Did you know that I had a second channel? You can go ahead yes, and subscribe. Yes, I did. Channel. It's all about you. You tell me what videos to make over there. It's pretty awesome. So for the first girl, I found her in a really weird way. Just let me explain. It was December 31st. Me and my girlfriend were at this wedding. The night was fun, all that. When we got home, we didn't really have much to do. We were just waiting for the new year. And that's when it went all down. So basically, we're both what was I doing on New Year? Just playing basketball with my friends, pretty much. <laughs> Giving Clifford potion to my puppy at 3 a.m. He transformed into cursed what? And all of a sudden, I heard some girl talking about we bought a Clifford the Red Dog potion. That made me jump out of my chair. What the f is my girlfriend watching? Yeah, why is your girlfriend watching that? To see what she was watching, and I was about to vomit. She told me she was watching it because she found this cringy girl and she was laughing at it. A few days later, I just kept thinking about that video. What normal person would make their dog drink a Clifford potion? I couldn't I hold don't know. Longer. I had to watch the video. <laughs> ah, my ears. Why is it so loud and what in the world did she just say? What did she just say? Oh my god, guy. What? I've heard people say, oh my god, guys, but I've never heard somebody say, oh my god, guy. It must be something new for 20 I know, what? What to expect. I wouldn't be surprised if like Steve from Minecraft was at the door or Santa or something. Basically. Like oh my god! That's the Grinch! Whoa! The Grinch? Why is the Grinch here? What is that voice? I'm lost. The title of this video says Giving Clifford Potion to My Puppy at 3 a.m. Why is the Grinch in your house? Oh my God, guys, this is a she just chucked the Happy Meal bag. What was that? Oh my God, guys, we got some water and we put some coloring in it. Guys, she's drinking the potion of Clifford. Oh my God. 
Uh oh. She's drinking dead water. <laughs> oh my god, my cat is eating food. What's the dog doing? What the dog doing? My dog does that on like a daily basis. I don't know why my dog just runs around my house and just starts rolling around on the floor being a really weird dog. So since I'm a dog owner, I can clarify that my dog does that a lot. So after the dog had a seizure, they... I don't know what that 100% means yet because I don't really like pay attention to what my dog I mean, ask my sister what that means if the dog just rolls around. But from my educated guess, that might mean the dog needs to go to the bathroom. And they're just not letting the dog go to the bathroom for the video. But that's just me. I'm not like a dog maniac. Freddy Fazbear? I swear, these people love to bully their dog. I know! Stole their dog and like that dog's adorable. I want that dog. What kind of name is that? Uh, Alice Spy Ninjas at 3 a.m. So these people are just a Chad Bar Clay lip off. So it's our dog's birthday, so she's gonna get kidnapped by Pennywise. Oh my gosh. What are those baby slaps? <laughs> Here's Just kick him in the, you know where, and punch him in the face. Hit him with the combos. Oh my god, he's going outside of the house. Oh my god, behind me. Can you restore me? Oh my god. Did you hear the dog whining? If this was real, these people would be chasing after Pennywise. He'd be sprinting as fast as he can away to try and get the dog. But no, they're walking like... How fast my sister walks, extremely slow. And I'm kidding, my sister can go decently quick, but I'm like twice as fast as my sister. <laughs> no offense. But still, they're walking like a freaking sloth. Even Pennywise is walking like a sloth. What? <laughs> they had their friend come take their dog into the cold weather outside with a scary costume on. The dog was crying. And the dog was crying? Do they even care about their dog? Like, it gets worse. Watch. Oh my god, where is Pennywise going? Guys, what should I do? Oh my god, god. Oh my god, where did he go? Where did he go? Oh no. Where did he go? Huh, I have no idea. He just closed the door. Did he teleport behind me or something? Where did he go? Okay, yeah, so somebody's breaking into your car. And you can tell that this is not at 3 a.m. This seems more like it's 7 or 8 p.m. because... If you saw for a split second there in the background, there was just a tiny smidge of light. And light means sun. And it's not like the sun rises up at 3 a.m. or sets at 3 a.m. Let's just stand right there, tap on the car a couple times, and tell him to stop. He drives away with the car, and she's like... Like, you can see it right there. He's too strong. Like, bro, he has your dog still. I ended up watching a few more videos from this Alice girl. And the spy ninjas at 3 a.m.? But I had to do something about Wait, I just saw Chad Wild claim one of the thumbnails. You'll see if she answers later on. Two thousand followers. That I made a video about the most I'm almost halfway to one thousand followers on YouTube. Hit that subscribe button and I'll get a thousand subscribers in hopefully a week. Rebecca Zamolo. She's pregnant? It takes nine months for, like, a baby to get that big. How does it happen in nine minutes? So you're telling me she's still posting videos about being pregnant? She was doing that two years ago, and now she's still doing it? I bet you there was a balloon inside of her shirt. That's what it was. The yes, no challenge. I will be holding an item over your head, but you can't see it if you say yes, and you keep the item, but if you say no, you don't get it, so good luck. Item number one. Yes or no? I'm going with no. No. Oh, that was a big mistake. You could have had ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand dollars? Scripted. Yep, she's still cringy, just like I remember her. Being a kid is so much better than being an adult, right, Polly? Katie, you better not tell mom that I'm using her china. She's literally 
acting like a kid. Remember, she's like 30 what? years old. What? That's like your mom doing this stuff. 39. Your mom making videos like this. I want to look at a girl that posts the nastiest videos ever. I don't even think my parents make YouTube videos unless they secretly do. Well, I think my mom does, but so I really didn't know what to for like, I don't know, work, something like that. Being mean okay, to so my mate. Suffering, watching one of her videos, what? To find the worst one the... In this video, and I found ah. this. Once we like learn how to be a lifeguard, we're actually gonna go to Rebecca's house and you know. Rebecca Zamola. Be... What? Two of the worst girls on YouTube did a collab. I oh no. I don't think I can watch this. I, I don't even know. No, I won't go in the hot tub then. Yep. That's fine. Hot tub clothes, water, water slides. No, got it. Oh, what happened this time? Oh! What did I just watch? That one guy got pushed into the pool and then everybody started screaming and just jumping in the pool. What did I just witness, honestly? That was the most cursed thing I've ever seen in my life. With people who are old enough to be their parents and they're all screaming throughout the whole 33 minute video. 33 minutes? 200,000 likes! My YouTube channel. And she's pregnant. Of course. Ask the baby if it's okay. What? Bro, Rebecca Zamolo, Zamala, whatever, has acted like she is giving birth so many times. Oh my gosh. That when she's actually about to give birth, nobody's going to believe her. They're just going to be like, ha, nice prank, you pulled this prank on me 20 times before <laughs> dying over there shooting out a baby well most okay why is there a baby just floating well most likely all of her friends would actually believe her if she really was pregnant because it would take nine months piper raquel and rebecca zamolo are both french but this video piper <laughs> raquel has nine million subscribers and alice at 3 a.m spy ninja whatever the, her name is is the i forgot about alice spy ninjas at 3 a.m dog doesn't like it so here's what i did about that i went over to her instagram to message her and i said is there any reason you make 3 a.m videos instead of normal videos but i didn't really expect to get an answer i expected her to ignore me so i had to do something else i had to dive deeper and that's when i decided to go into detective i knew that she wasn't going to answer me so i'm so tired in her videos. how many huggy wuggy vi wait I forgot about Poppy Playtime's existence up until just now. It's like Poppy Playtime died and nobody even noticed. That's like the same thing as what happened with Friday Night Funkin'. It just died and nobody even realized. Like you can see in the background right there, there's like some light coming from that area. Yeah. found somebody though that might be her boyfriend so on every single video she posted on instagram there's one account who comments like three lily stable videos. most of the time it's like three emojis though it's like a crying emoji happy emoji clapping emoji is that, that is just cursed lily that yeah, no. never mind i don't think that is i was searching everywhere for this dude and i finally might have found him so in a video where they turn into the imposter at 3 a.m they start playing Among Us. And oh, I wanted to see if I could see his username while he was playing the game. Because if it said, like, Felix, then I could look for a Felix and try to find him. But his username just said me. Wow, this guy's smart. Very sneaky. But then I found something else. 
in a video titled, Nobody Came to Her Chuck E. Cheese Birthday Party. He said, nobody came to my sister's birthday. Oh my sister? God, my sister's birthday party! Their brother and sister, that helps a lot. I still couldn't Interesting. find this dude. I found the girl, no problem, but this dude is a ninja. It's January <clears throat> 17th now. More than two weeks have passed since the last part of this video. After I was searching for a while for this guy, I gave up. I thought I would never find him. But then I got a message. A message from a few of my friends. A couple weeks ago, I told huh? them that I couldn't find this dude. And they just I think the friends must have found him. I'm not sure how, but they did. And his name is Fresh Freddy. Fre I found something odd on Fresh Freddy's channel. I see the Clifford video right there. Alice posted something about how nobody came to her birthday party or whatever. Don't call him Inquisitor Master. That's video, Do you not FaceTime Blippy the kid YouTuber? That I was just reading the titles of the video that I saw, and there was some cursed one. The exact same video. At that moment, I went to his video. What is that? His Instagram and Twitter in his description, and I went out to message him. His sister didn't answer me, probably because she thought I was a 75-year-old creep or something, but this guy's gonna answer me. Possibly, Whenever but probably not. Channels, though, I couldn't see how many subscribers they had. I was really mad about that. Each video had I think Social Blade actually bypasses those rules. Since Social Blade gets analytics directly from YouTube. I can go to Social Blade right now and search up Alice Spine Injuries at 3 a.m. And then it would say how many subscribers they have. Which would be helpful, but I don't think DJ Cook knows about that. Around like 10 to 20,000 views. So I was thinking that they had about 70,000 subscribers. On Fresh Freddy's Twitter, the girl's brother, his name says Fresh Freddy 250,000 subscribers. You're telling me the dude who gave his what? dog red liquid has 250,000 people subscribed to How? Him? That doesn't make any sense. So I messaged this Freddy dude Probably on January 17th. Probably like 250 the next day, I checked my messages subscribers. And he <laughs> just only 250. Just like his sister. Maybe dude, 1,500. I don't know, but not that much. They're ignoring me. I don't know why they're ignoring me, though. Like, well, actually, Do they know who he is? They're too busy torturing their dog for views on YouTube. Oh, yeah, true. There's some really weird scamming going on on YouTube right now, and that's what I'm going like to go Like the Robux scams. Got to go work on that right now. Be ready for my next video. We're going to take down some YouTube scammers. Okay, that... Okay, what was that? That video that's coming up next seems hype. The exposing scammers video, that video seems like it would be a good poggers moment. So... Leave a like and subscribe so you will get notified when I make a video reacting to DJ Cook's future video where he exposes some scammers. I'm sure that video will be good. And also, in the next week, I will react to the other two videos that I forgot to react to made by DJ Cook. So stay tuned for those as well. Thanks for watching. Bye.